Which means all praises to Yahweh, which is the true name of the people, the name of the uh, Heavenly Father, who you people call God by Hashem, which is in the name, okay? Um, of Yahweh, Shah, which is the name of the only begotten Son, who you people ignorantly call Jesus Christ. Those are the true names of the Heavenly Father and the Son. I do want to give a shout out to the Akim that's pushing his word throughout the four corners of the earth, who's also uplifting the names of Yahweh, Yahweh Shah. And to your confusion of faces out there whose bloodline traces back to Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, or forefathers, though you may look like one of the heathen nations that you are scattered amongst. Same thing to if your, uh, your uh, spirit bear witness with this word and this truth, and you can receive it as if you're one of the children of the Most High, okay? And... If your sea line goes back to the same thing to these people on this chart through the man, okay? Through the man. And um to you few sisters that do listen and learn, shalom to the elect of the nation of Israel, wherever you may be scattered throughout the four corners of the earth, who this world is going out to, shalom to you. Once again, to you so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans. Okay, you consist to make up the twelve tribes of Israel. Okay, you are the um the Hebrew Israelites by blood. Okay, that is your true nationality. Okay, you are the chosen people of Yahweh by Shmi Yahweh Shah. Okay, and um I'm back. You know, with the Mark of the Beast update. You know, I'm been keeping. You know, make sure every time some uh. uh Article comes out about the uh, RFID chip, you know, that I'm on it. In case you didn't know, the RFID chip is the mark of the beast, okay? So, fear the microchip. <laughs> but it says, under skin chip implants as small, as few as grains of sand used for payments at Mobile World Congress. Okay? It says... A man volunteered to have a chip inserted on his skin live on stage at a trade fair in Barcelona on Monday. And another man who had already undergone the procedure showed off how he could make a payment with it using his smartphone. Edgar Pond said he decided to have the radio frequency identification RFID chip implanted because it contains credentials to open the door to his house. It is super for me, very useful. Because I have an automatic house, he said, adding he was further motivated by the fact he could withdraw. It's very easily simply making a little cut and pressing it. As Pons was undergoing the procedure, Alex Rodriguez Vitello, a, a, site, a, a, a scientist, engineer, Curator and uh, explorer at Barcelona-based technology company Alpha said the chip is the size of a grain of sand or two. It is covered in a material that is biocompatible, so our body does not de 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 degrade it over time. And that's a lie, man. Okay? That's a, a bold-faced lie. Okay? During the presentation at the Mobile World Congress organized by Spanish Bank Sabadell, a man named Paul, who had already been fitted with a chip, made a payment by placing his smartphone over the skin covering the chip. What we have been seeing now is what the future of payments could be, and it's not what it could be, it is what it's going to be, said Anna Pygorio, a financial service manager at Sabadell. So that's the article right there, man. Okay? That's the article. So I'm just going to get straight into it. This ain't going to be long because, you know, I do plenty of uh, these videos. So you should be, you know, used to it. But this is to anybody that's new, okay? So I'm just going to get straight to the point. This is Revelations 13. It's taking forever to load all of a sudden. It's Revelations 13, verse 16. It says, and he, once again, if you don't know what it's talking about, it's talking about Esau Edom, okay? Esau Edom 
is the so-called white man, okay? But it's starting with the elite banking families because that's who has the power of the earth right now, okay? And that's who's trying to push this microchipping, which is a part of the new world order, okay? In cause of all, both small and great, rich and poor, free and bond, so it's, it comes from all, it's going to be uh, pushed on all manners of life. It don't matter if you're rich, poor, okay? Successful, not successful, it don't matter, man. Okay, how old you are, how uh, young you are, it don't matter. Everybody. To receive a mark in their right hand or in their full heads, okay? And then that mark, just look up the RFID chip or the microchip implant and you'll see that mark, what it's talking about, okay? But I always do this. Let's go into the word mark. The word here is, let's just put it. Strong's G, 5480, Haragma. 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 Okay. A stamp. So let's go into it. A stamp and imprinted mark. Okay. Of the mark stamp on the forehead or the right hand is the badge of the follower of the Antichrist, man. Okay. The mark branded upon horses, things carved, sculptured, graven work of idolatrous works, man. A scratch, etching, stamp, a badge of servitude, okay? So, let's go into etymology. Got this out today. Let's go in the word etching. I looked up imprint. Um, Alright, this is the word. A etching. Also, the art of engraving. Okay. In 16, uh, uh, 1660s. So, let's go in the word engraving. It all ties into one thing if you think about it, engraving. Okay, engraving, engraving. Acts of cutting, of cutting designs, ecstasy on hard surfaces, okay? Meaning that which is engraved from the 1610s, meaning expression from, taken from an engraved plate. So it means cutting, man, okay? So this, this means this mark, okay, as it says in uh, Revelations 13 and 16 verse, okay, that means this mark is going to be a physical mark, okay, it's not spiritual, okay, it's not the mark of Ezekiel 9 and 4, as some people like to say, man, okay, Ezekiel 9 and 4 is a spiritual mark, okay, but this mark is physical and it's, it's going to be uh, uh, pushed to the world by Esau Edom, man. Okay, because he wants to microchip the masses. Okay, so this is a physical mark, and it tells you in the scriptures that's a law. Okay. I forgot what, I think it's Leviticus. Yeah, it is, there it is. This is law, okay? This is law for you Israelites, man, okay? You so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans, okay? Ye shall, this is Leviticus 19 and 28. Ye shall not make any cuttings in your flesh for the dead, nor print any marks upon you. I am the Lord, okay? So that's a law, okay? So... To you so-called Negroes, okay, you know, as it's going to say as I read on in the verse, to you so-called Negroes that take, okay, this mark of the beast or the RFID chip as it is, okay, you're breaking, already breaking, okay, one of the laws, there's plenty of laws you'll be breaking, okay, thou shalt not uh, uh, make a covenant with the heathen. Okay, that's a, another um, law you'll be breaking because when you take this chip, you're making the covenant with Esau. Basically saying that you would like for him to uh, be your ruler, which I'm about to get. 
So I'm going to read the 17th verse. And that no man might buy or sell save he that had the mark on the name of the beast or the number of his name. Okay? At least the EU and NATO. Okay? So, that is saying it might buy or sell. And that's what these people in this article I just read you. That's what they're doing, man. Okay? They're buying, making payments with this the, uh, this RFID chip, man. Okay, so this book is faithful and true, man. Okay? This is real, man. We're seeing, we're witnessing prophecy, okay, in our face, man. The RFID chip is alive and it is real, okay? It's not made up, okay? Neither is this book, okay? These scriptures. Here's the wisdom. Let him that have understanding count the number of the beast, for it is the number of a man, the number of his, his number is six. Hundred three score and six 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 six. Okay. And Esau eat him, the so called white man. He is the devil, man. Okay. Revelations fourteen and nine. Here's the consequences to you so called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans who take this chip. Okay. And the third angel falls them saying with a loud voice, if any man worship the beast in his image, the system. And receive his mark in his forehead or in his hand, the same shall drink of the wine of the wrath of Yahweh, which is poured without mixture into the cup of his indignation. And he shall be tormented with fire and brimstone in the presence of the holy angels and the presence of the Lamb. Okay? And the smoke of the torment ascended up forever and ever. They have, they have no rest, they know not who worship the beast in his image, and whosoever received the mark of his name. Okay? So you're going to die by the missiles, as I always say. You're going to die a terrible and slow death. As it says, okay, in the chat, uh, the book of Zechariah, the 14th chapter, the 12th verse, okay, how you're going to burn up through those missiles, the, the, how your eyeballs and your tongue going to consume into your mouth and your eyeballs consume into your, your eye, your sockets, man, okay? And here's another one, Revelation 16, verse 1. And I heard a great voice of the temple saying to the seven angels, go your, go to your, go your ways, and pour out the vials of the wrath of Yahweh upon the earth. And the first went and poured out his vials upon the earth. And there fell a noisome and grievous sore. A grievous sore upon the men which had the mark of the beast. The RFID chip. Upon them which worshipped this image, man. Okay? So that's the first one that they're going to go after, man. Is you, you people that took. You Israelites, okay? That took you so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans. And the confusion of faces. Okay? Who took that chip? You're gonna have a terrible death. That's just the point, man. You're gonna die a terrible death for taking that chip. Okay, so here's your warning. Okay, and we're gonna keep, like I said, we're gonna keep, no matter how irritating it gets or how boring it gets, and keep putting this message out until it manifests itself completely. Okay, but you are warned not to take that chip, and you can't say you wasn't warned, man. Okay, when this day come. Okay, when this man pushes his chip on the masses, you can't say that you weren't warned. Okay, if you take that chip to you Israelites, man. Okay? But uh, that's my you know, short uh, update on the mark of the beast. You know, Lord willing, this is edifying. I want to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shah. Peace to the uh, elect, whatever it may be.